All right, this time we're gonna install some cinnamon applets. Um, there's a few ways to get there. So one way is to right click on your panel and then you go add applets, right? And then you have this screen. Another way to get there is just go to menus and then you go to your cinnamon settings and uh, you click on applets. Basically, that's the only way to get there here. Um, as far as enabling and disabling it, you can just go to, let's say for example, we have this trash here, applet here. Just check the box right and you have your little trash uh, icon here well it depends on what applet does but this one's the trash so that's how you do that uh, if you want to disable it just uncheck it and then it's gone now let's say you enable it and you want to rearrange it all you gotta do is right click on your panel here and go to edit mode right right now is this little what's that red thing over here when you click on it it will be green and now you have this little green uh, what is that highlight or whatever that means you're in edit mode and then you can drag and drop these uh, to different places so let's say for example I don't want my trash to be here I want to drag it over here or something next to the sound right uh, so you can do this with any other the other applets you have on your uh, system here rearrange it the way that you want but after you're done you just go right click on it again and go uh, disable your edit mode and then um, that's pretty much it for that now if you want to get some new applets, you just click on here and it should open up your browser. And this is from the Cinnamon, or well, not Cinnamon, I mean the Linux Mint's website. And they do have a few here, so we didn't install one. Uh, but how would you do this? Basically you have to do this manually, right? You have to download it and then you want to uh, extract it or decompress it here to this location. So if you're new and you don't know like how the hell you're supposed to do this, I'll give you an example here. So let's say for example we would install uh, force quit, right? Click on this and then we go download, click on download and save it. This just saves it to your um, your download folder. So let's open containing folder here. All right, this is my download folder. Let me uh, minimize these two here. But basically all you do is uh, right click on here and extract here and it should give you a folder here, all right? Now what you want to do is um, open a new tab. So click on your what's that your home folder or whatever it is. Uh, middle click on it, and now you have a new tab here. So you have two tabs. Now over here, you want to see your hidden files. So to do that, is just hit Control and H, and then you see all your little dot folders here. What you want to do is go to dot loco, right? Dot loco uh, share, and then go to cinnamon and then go to applets um, and now all you gotta do is just drag and drop this folder in there right and there you go you have your um, applets installed that's basically how, how you install it now it doesn't show up here if you have this open you have to go out of that and then go back into it and then you should see like uh, what's that we have force quit now if you don't like you know want to do like normally like this you can actually filter it out just type in force and then it'll come out uh, real quick right there. And then just enable it, you know, the checkbox. And now you have force quit. Uh, if you don't know what force quit is, is basically a way to kill an application if, you know, it's frozen or something like that. Let's say, for example, if this window is frozen and you can't click X out of it or whatever, you can actually just click on this thing and then point to the window you want to kill. So I want to kill this window and then it kills it, right? Anyways, that's how you install applets uh, manually for Cinnamon Desktop. That'll be it for this one.